We just keep getting swarmed with more and more customers. It's been non-stop work for so long, Paimon's starting to feel a little bit lightheaded. We've got a lot of orders. Paimon's not sure we can fill them all on our own. Uh, maybe we should hire some help. Taking a break, cuties? I was just looking at the sales data, and it seems like you two have quite the talent for business. The potions seem to be flying off the shelves. Oh, Lisa! Perfect timing. We were just talking about how we could use some help around the shop. Oh, are the orders piling up already? Having trouble keeping up? Yep, we're officially swamped. Paimon never thought we'd get this many customers. Well, I can't say I'm surprised by the success. I was actually anticipating this kind of response. While you two were busy with the shop, I was talking with Freda about some possible ways to make the business more efficient. After observing your work, I made note of several improvements we can make to the brewing, cultivation, and sales aspects of the business. Wait, so you've been doing things behind the scenes this whole time? Slacking off. <laughs> hey now, I'm actually pretty reliable when it counts. So how are we supposed to put those improvements in action? Well, I discussed things over with Freda, and the two of us came up with a plan. I'll let her give you the details, though. Why don't you go and find her? Traveler! Paimon, hello! Is there something I can help you with? Well, we've been a bit swamped lately, so Lisa recommended we find some ways to increase our efficiency. Ah, yes. I've discussed that with her as well. Currently, there are three areas you can improve. Brewing, cultivation, and sales. Increasing your efficiency in these areas will make it much easier to run your business. Wow, that sounds just like what we need! Let's give it a try, Traveler! Looks like... all the preparations needed for this upgrade have been made. Please, try it out. Hmm, Traveler? Paimon? Huh, <laughs> looks like you're running a business. Oh, hey, Diona! And Tone Deaf Bard. What brings you to the shop? I could smell what you were brewing from all the way across Cider Lake. Bards have an extremely keen sense of smell, you know. Again with the nonsense! Don't listen to him! We were actually in the middle of looking for some cocktail ingredients. Margaret is getting ready to run a new promotion at the Cocktail, so... She asked me to come up with some new drink ideas. The bard over here is performing at the event. When he saw me getting ready to leave, he insisted on tagging along to help! Well, what better way to be the first to try your new concoction than by helping you collect ingredients? Well, that explains your enthusiasm then. You're only that generous when alcohol is involved. Anyway, I was having some trouble coming up with new ideas for ingredients to use. I've already experimented with just about every ingredient you can find around Mondstadt. Even the weirdest ones. The bar saw me struggling and told me he had an idea. So we split up for a while. I didn't get my hopes up. But sure enough, he came back a little while later with a rare ingredient I'd never used before. Ooh, what is it? Some sort of secret? Come on, bring it out so we can see. <laughs> it's a bird feather I found on a ruin in Dragon Spine. It was once buried in the snow, and is still cold to the touch even now. I'm sure it could be used to produce a drink with an entirely new sort of mouthfeel. Whoa! Well, if anyone can find something like that, Paimon supposes it'd be you. Unfortunately, this ingredient is not easy to find. We'll probably use up the measly amount we discovered with just the recipe! 
Play testing alone! Don't worry about the ingredients, Diona. I'll figure something else out. You should head back so you can get a head start on working that mixology magic of yours. Uh-huh. Because the sooner I get started, the sooner you get to take advantage of the fruits of my labor. <laughs> Isn't that right? Uh, well, just think of it as a way to pay me in advance for all my hard work. <laughs> that still doesn't solve our problem, though. Traveler, Paimon, do you have any ideas for a new drink? Huh? Infuse drinks with different effects? But doesn't that bring us back to the ingredient problem all over again? Oh, Paimon gets what he's saying! Ahem. You're looking at one of the most popular duos on the Mondstadt alchemy scene right now. Our potions are one of the hottest commodities in Tibet! Ugh, but what do potions have to do with drinks? You can add them as an ingredient, of course! Potions can add all sorts of different effects! For example, with a little alchemy on your side, you could even make a drink that can heal a broken heart. Wow! I never knew potions could do something like that! Hmm, I see. How about a potion that makes people never want to drink alcohol again? Could you make something like that? Whoa, whoa, whoa! Don't go making promises we can't keep, Traveler! How are we supposed to make a potion like that? Ugh, what a shame. And here I thought I'd finally be able to dismantle the entire Mondstadt wine industry in one fell swoop. It's okay. We'll try to see if we can find some other ways to help. Actually, I've always been curious, Diona. Is there a particular reason you don't like alcohol? <laughs> Isn't it obvious? Ever been around a drunk person before? Let me tell you, it's not a pleasant experience. Ah, so your gripe isn't really with alcohol itself, but the fact that it makes people drunk. Hmm, this may sound a little weird, but I wonder if it's possible to use this mysterious alchemy craft of yours to make a drink that prevents people from getting intoxicated. So you mean a potion that can keep someone sober and awake? Huh, sounds like something we could do. What do you say, Traveler? Perfect! <laughs> I can just see it now. The more alcohol those drunkards consume, the more sober they'll become! They'll finally have to say bye bye to their days of drunken depravity! It's decided then. Please make me a potion that can keep people sober! I gotta say, I'm starting to get really curious about what that drink's going to taste like. Ingredient collecting went a lot faster with my help, didn't it? <laughs> Come on, admit it. Well, I suppose you weren't entirely useless. So, how's the potion coming? Finished yet? Up Mondstadt's entire wine industry in my own two hands! Wowza! Thank you so much. Oh, I'm gonna head back and start developing my new drinks right away! Wait! Don't leave without me! I thought you were gonna let me be the taste tester! Of course! <laughs> Operation Eliminate Drunkards has just begun, and you, my friend, are my first test subject! <laughs> 
<laughs> and just like that, another problem solved. Looks like you've done it again, Traveler and Paimon. Alcohol that doesn't make you drunk. Ooh, if I'm able to develop something like that, I guess there really is a type of alcohol that I can get behind. 